So what up YouTube, Nate here from Thrift Dweller, coming at you with, I guess it's like a vlog, vlog slash pickup video. Uh, they lifted a little bit or they loosened a little bit of the restrictions in our city. So uh, I was actually able to go to the thrift store for the past couple days. It's been really nice. I was able to spend time with my family again, which is uh, means the world to me at this time. We're following all rules, all safety protocols. Uh, but yeah, check it out earlier today. <laughs> The stabilization on this phone is amazing. Better be the pricing box. So yeah, we got a pretty bad snowfall the other day. Beautiful though. The weather reminds me of old thrift dweller. <laughs> Finally at the thrift store. God damn, maybe I'll buy that. Yeah, we're gonna go right away, son, promise. What's that five ninety nine? You're the winner. Oh yeah. If there's one music group that makes me feel Canadian, it's BNL, Bare Naked Ladies. That. What year is this one? Look at these kids. Oh, that looks so 90s. If I had a million dollars. Yes, babe? You see anything there? Wow, look at that. Bubble bath Game Boy. Oh, and it's still full. Holly, I'm going to buy this. Whoa, it's a whole wall of wrestling. But they are eight bucks a piece. I'll get that. You want that? Yes, please. And then, there is this one. You want that one? Yes, I do want that one. We will open that at home. Okay, I'm gonna pick what I think might be worth it. I think Razor is not that one. No, don't buy Tech Decks. Some Taker action. A little bit of AJ there. Oh, look at this. Mummy's alive. No, who is this? I said Jericho was a uh, zombie. I might buy that one. Let's say Dallas 316. Oh, that's a pretty cool stone coal. I'm gonna pick that up. It's like super dead in here today, which is awesome. How's the camera working out, guys? Let me know in the comments below. But anyways, this is what I got so far. Look what I found, honey. Lino with a sword. Lino. I found this Pop Andre. And then this was, I think, Jericho as a mummy. And this is 98 Degrees on the Tunes. Ruthless Aggression, Cena. Fun of Mach. Austin, this is Dallas 316. Anyways, I'm gonna look these up before I buy them, though. Just wanted to show you in case I put them back here. This is another. Gold dust, a Bray. I think Bray will be good. A Roman. Man, I used to love hockey cards back in the day, and I never liked watch hockey. My wife just walked by these. You don't even know what these are. Please don't go, girl. Look at those pants. Oh, mullet tail. So sexy. What did you put in there, Haley? Another Barbie? You think you just throw it in there and Daddy won't notice? Daddy sees everything. So does Mommy. So does Mommy, you're right. Look at that, though. Only one Barbie. And Louise, I think you have a... Excuse me? Who's <laughs> this guy? Look at that guy. There was a fight one time in our schoolyard, and I swear to God, marbles this big, they chucked it at the other kid's head. That's why they got banned at our school.
Look at that one. That's a cool picture. You know what's annoying right now? Is those people with the phones that just scan the books. That's like cheating. Bunch of Mr. Beans. No offense to you if you do that, by the way. Just a friendly jab. Can't wait to get home and uh, show you guys what's in the bag. And this is pretty much all the pickups. The final pickup video of 2020. If we haven't said it enough on the channel, all the best in 2021. Uh, thank you for joining me at the end of the year here. I'll do like a wrap up video for the end of the year, but uh, for now, pickups. This is like the worst. The paper bag, it's so loud on the mic. Um, in no particular order, we will have the best pickup for the end of the video. Though. The maple syrup pickup of the video. We will bring that back in 2021. First up, Impulse at the last thrift store that I went to today. Factory sealed uh, Disney VHS tapes. I should have looked these up before I bought them. Here you have Cinderella. Uh, here you have Aristocats. Aristocats. This one is Lady and the Tramp. And my jam, uh, my second favorite Disney movie that ever came out. A little bit of damage on the inside of this. Beauty and the Beast. Hopefully those are showing up okay on camera. There's like a hole at the top here. And I think that's just like degradation of the plastic because there's no trauma as evidenced by uh, the factory seal that's still intact here. I thought, you know, I knew these weren't rare, but I thought they were less common than what I expected them to be. I looked them up on eBay after I bought them and I'm like, God damn, there's a lot. This one I was really happy about. Uh, the bag was, is that $2.99? $3.99 minus 20% off with our coupon. I don't know if you can see what's inside there. Keen-eyed thrift dwellers. There's this guy, I had this one growing up as a kid actually, from the Ninja Turtles line. I don't know who this guy is. I can get him to focus on the camera there. Who is this guy? I forget. I had him growing up though. But uh, the most impressive thing to me, hell, there's a little bit of paint on his legs. Stone protectors. I don't know which stone protector he is, but he comes with like his wand thingy. That's pretty cool, right? I don't know. I played the Super Nintendo game. I don't really remember. I vague memories of the show. I'll put the intro of the show here. We're the stone protectors. Our stones of power global. I'm Maxwell. And I rip on lead guitar. Kill a lick. Pay me $100 on Patreon and that'll be my haircut in 2021. After I grow it back, of course. I'm kidding about that. We're never going to have Patreon, I don't think. Thrift Dweller is a group. I personally don't ever want Patreon, but, you know, majority rules here. This is just going back to the elimination bin. I love my uh, Google Pixel. It's great. That's a wide-angle lens, but here's an overview of the items. I already showed one bag off over here. I showed Homeboy off here. But yeah, this is an overview of everything here. Next, we'll pick up this one here. $3.99 minus 20% off. You can see... A little bit of uh, Pokemon there. Pokemon, actually. got Minichino. Is that Snivy? Uh, this Snivy is from McDonald's 2011. I don't really keep McDonald's ones, sadly. This Minichino. I don't know when this one came. When was this one? 2011. It's a Jax. Jax Pacific. So, yeah, this is the Minichino. He's cute, like 2011 Jax. A little bit of, uh, needs a fig bath. But yeah, cute, cute. And uh, this was the Ivysaur. I have no idea when this guy came. So the, if you can read there, it says 2000 Hasbro. And uh, looks like he does some sort of, looks like he does some sort of like leaf. I'm probably breaking this thing. If anyone knows in the comments below, please let me know. I love early Pokemon toys. They have such a different look to them. Uh, these books will come into play in a little bit, but they have such a different look to them compared to like what we know today.